Shannon, The Girl's Got Soul, here with week four of my health journey. And I'm actually recording this on uh, Saturday night. Um, I had a busy day. I ran uh, the Lady Track Shack 5K. I'm wearing the uh, quarter zip we got, and it is, is awesome. It is so comfortable. They gave us quarter zips for the last two OUCs, and I'm in love with the quarter zips. Um, we don't get to wear them a ton here in Florida, but this is the time of year for quarter zips. And this is my favorite thing. Not only would I run to layer, but I can wear like a t-shirt and my jeans, and I can go out, and um, I'm super comfortable. Um, but let's get down to business here. <laughs> uh, I weighed myself this morning before I headed out. Um, this morning what I did was um, I met up with some friends um, in Galloway and we ran uh, about three, a little over three miles to the race from our normal starting uh, location and um, then I did the 5k. So before I left this morning, I made sure to get on the scale and I'll be honest, I was a little concerned because this week's been a little funky. Um, I've had some uh, back issues and I've had some stomach issues. And, um, you know, and I did have Friday. I was a little, a little off plan, to be honest with you. I had a little extra snacks going on in there. Um, I wasn't, you know, hundred percent on my calorie intake. So I wasn't really sure what that scale would say. So I was pleasantly surprised when the scale said this morning that I had lost more weight. And as of today, as of week four, I am down 2.2 pounds. So I'm thrilled by this. That means I've gone from, I've gone to 131.6 as of this morning. So I started at 133.6, uh, 133, yeah, 133.6. Uh, I'm probably going to have to edit this because I thought I had that down. Um, but I weighed this morning, like I said, I did calculate it out that it was um, a 2.2 uh, pounds total. So considering that I wasn't sure with all my week how it went. It was a little rocky for me. So, um, and I did not, I ended up stopping my planks because I had some lower back pain and it actually was creeping back in a bit uh, this morning, even on I ran. So I'm hoping that that's something I can uh, get rid of. So, um, yeah, I'm not, you know, I, I have a history of uh, um, back issues um, slightly, but for the most part, I've been blessed that it's not hanging around. So, hopefully that will take a hike and I won't have to worry about that anymore. As far as the week, you know, like I said, besides the fact that I felt I wasn't sure what that scale would say this morning, um, I'm uh, pretty happy with that. And, um, you know, we'll see what happens in week five. So, I guess the first month um, went, you know, pretty darn good. You know, losing just over two pounds. Um, I'm pretty happy with that, and I would um, consider that a uh, double thumbs up. Hey, it is Sunday. <laughs> I almost said Monday. <laughs> it's not Monday yet. Jeez, let's not forward to Monday just yet. Um, that's a work day. <laughs> so um, today's uh, Sunday, and uh, the beginning of week four, and um, I just did my bike workout. Um, I did about 12 and a half miles, and then I did um, a minute and 10 seconds plank and I did um, 25 push-ups so that's my workout for Sunday um, of course yeah, I'm still on track for my food um, and uh, it is what about almost 1 30 so I'm actually gonna have lunch after I shower and I'm usually pretty good but I'll keep it under my calories on Sunday so Sunday ends up being a um, fairly uh, easy day I think for me to stay on track uh, I've noticed it seems that Work days are harder. I guess it's because um, I sit at a computer all day long and uh, you just start getting, um, thinking, ah, I'm in the munchies or something. So, uh, and plus I'm also tired when I'm working, you're staring at a computer screen all day. So um, hopefully we can stay on track and uh, we will see how the rest of the week goes. It is Monday morning and I just finished my bike workout. And Toby's back there. Same. And uh, we actually just watched uh, the first two episodes of um, WandaVision while I was doing the bike workout. Interesting show. Um, I'm not sure what to think of it yet. Obviously, there's more to it. But, um, you know, being a Marvel fan that I am, I um, had to uh, watch it. Um, so we got the uh, bike workout done. 
I'm going to try to do my um, plank and push-ups later. Um, my back started to bother me last night, so my lower back, so I'm not sure what the deal is with that. So uh, I don't want to do any uh, any crazy stuff with it um, for a little while. So I think I'll probably wait till either into the work day on a break or um, tonight after work. So, um, but it's Monday and uh, overall, except for that, I'm feeling pretty good. Today is Tuesday, and this is actually, I'm recording this in the evening, um, a little before dinner. Well, I've been dealing with some, uh, a little bit of a, um, a hiccup, I guess, or, or you know, a, a pause in her plans. Um, as of like Monday or so, I started having some, uh, some lower back pain. And um, I'm not sure what the deal is with that. So, um... Other than that, I've been feeling all right, all right, but I don't mess around with back pain, uh, especially since um, a few years back before I started really running um, the Galloway plan, I had a uh, herniated disc in my back, and I still have it, obviously, but um, it hasn't been bothering me um, thanks to um, Galloway run, walk, and all that. So when my back does decide to... Um, flare up, but I take it pretty seriously, um, which apparently is doing now. So as much as I really wanted to run this morning, I had to um, cancel that plan and uh, X out and uh, use today as a rest day instead. And it's really sad because it's like 66 degrees this morning and I was super looking forward to running in 66 degree weather here in Florida. However, I'm feeling a little bit better tonight. I did run to the store after work and I um, picked up some uh, um, some uh, heat patches you know um, what do they call them um, icy hot patches and I got some more biofreeze and I do have a, um, a little massager coming tomorrow from Amazon so and that'll be good not only for my back but it'll be good for like my shoulders and stuff so um, definitely a good investment nonetheless no matter what I use it for but I'm hoping I'm hoping that I'll feel a lot better um, in the morning because my hope is um, to uh, try to attempt the bike workout so we shall see how that goes and um, fingers crossed but more than that I'm uh, praying uh, that this will calm back down because uh, I've got Lady Track Check 5k on Saturday and I'm uh, really looking forward to doing it so um, I'm definitely uh, very hopeful at this point it is Wednesday morning and I actually just finished the bike workout. Uh, yesterday did not go not as planned at all. I um, had Monday, late Monday, I started getting a lot of lower back pain. So uh, I ended up having to skip my Tuesday run. And I hate missing a workout, especially a run. So that really kind of sucked. But um, thankfully, um, for the grace of God, I'm feeling better this morning. I'm, it's a little bit uh, sore, but I'm feeling a lot better. I was able to get on the bike for a while and uh, and uh, watch uh, some Disney Plus, watch some Marvel, and uh, I'm gonna take a shower and get ready for work. But um, thankfully, I'm feeling better, and um, hopefully, the rest of the week uh, continues. It is Wednesday evening, and as you can see, I'm actually a little um, dressed up. Or I don't know, I'm a little, <laughs> I'm definitely uh, made up more than I would um, for a workout or after a workout. Um, I'm going to be going live again with my my friend doing her paparazzi shortly. And um, so I wanted to do um, a quick little uh, update on the vlog. And as I had previously said, this week has been um, a little different as well. I had um, some back pain on Monday. I started experiencing some back pain. Uh, I think it was like, a little bit after my workout, uh, I didn't exactly know the time. At first, I just thought, you know, I'm just tired and a little sore. And then by uh, by the middle to the end of the work day, I was definitely feeling um, I was feeling it in my lower back, and then it actually radiated uh, a bit into my um, you know my upper legs and everything. So I guess I must have um, uh, pinched a nerve or um, something, something I don't know. Uh, only thing I can think of is that on Sunday evening I did uh, vacuum in the house, and it was it's a quite heavy of a vacuum. It's one of those huge, uh, 
not one of the light ones. So I, I figured moving that, you know, moving all the furniture and all that stuff around, I might have uh, knocked something out. So um, I'm real thankful, though, that I'm feeling a lot better today. It's still a little sore and a little tender, but I've been using the uh, Icy Hot patches on it. And uh, and I've also got some uh, BioFreeze, which I always have on hand as a runner. And I also have some other um, topical stuff. And then I bought uh, on Amazon, it just came today, one of those um, massaging pillows. Um, and it is uh, so cool. You can actually either stick it on your back. You can stick it anywhere on your back. You can stick it on your neck. Stick it on your arms, your legs, wherever you, wherever, you, know, you want to put it. So um, I think that's a really good investment for me anyway because being a runner, uh, having a massage is always great. <laughs> and uh, and I tell you what, the older you get, you appreciate a good massage. And I uh, definitely don't have the money to go get a massage. So uh, I think it was about $30, $35. So it was definitely a pretty good investment. Um, and uh, if anybody's interested in which one I got, um, I'll post it. But I think there's a few on Amazon that are in the $30, $40 range. So they're, they're pretty... Um, so far, I like it. I mean, I tried at the end of the workday. It came like my last couple hours of work. So, but as we were, as I was saying, um, today is uh, Wednesday, and I'm gonna go live with um, my friend for her paparazzi. And that's actually, if you ever see anywhere in jewelry, it's probably paparazzi. And paparazzi, in case you guys are not aware of it, it's five dollar jewelry. It's all lead and nickel free. And uh, these earrings are actually paparazzi. This necklace and this bracelet I have on. And like I said, I usually wear a lot of my jewelry as paparazzi. Uh, it's basically the same kind of stuff you can get at like Target or Pennies or Kohl's, but it's cheaper. So if you're interested in that, um, I can put you in the direction of my friend who sells paparazzi. Otherwise, um, that's where we're at at this point. And I'm looking forward to running in the morning with my girls. And uh, we will uh, go from there. And I uh, hope you guys are having a uh, good week. And uh, hopefully the rest of the week will be uneventful, is what I meant earlier. <laughs> Not um, anything else, just hopefully everything will go smoothly. That would be great. It is Thursday morning, and I just finished my run with the girls. And let me tell you, it's like 62 degrees, but it's so windy. It's like, it feels like the real feel is like in the 50s or something like that. It was so windy. The headwind was pretty awful. So, um, but... We got it done. We got negative splits, so I'm always happy to have negative splits. I think our overall pace was like 1318, so that's pretty awesome. And I'm wearing uh, last year's Lady Track Shack shirt because I'm running Lady Track Shack on Saturday, and I'm super excited. We're gonna run like uh, about two or three miles beforehand to get some uh, get some mileage in because I like to do six on Saturday for the minimum, typically speaking. So um, yeah, I think I'm probably gonna um, do uh, some video on that, but. Uh, but I'm looking forward to it, and uh, it's a great start to this Thursday. Okay, it's a great morning. Did a 5K before the 5K, so a total of 10K. It's a good Saturday run, and uh, feeling pretty good, and uh, a little cold, so I'm feeling good. <laughs> and I got to see a lot of friends and run with a friend, so to me, that's always thumbs up. And thanks again to Track Shack for putting on an amazing event. Thank you, Track Shack. All right, this is Saturday evening, and to close out week four, um, again, like I said, I've lost um, 2.2 pounds since I began my uh, health journey in 2021, and I'm uh, very thrilled, and I feel very thankful for that, and I thank you, everybody, for your support. It's definitely not an easy thing. Uh, anybody else who's working on their health and uh, losing weight, um, Keep going, guys. It's it's not easy, and keep chugging along, and we're all gonna get there. I, you know, we really will.